Crabs and when? Well, we've just gone ashore to sort out the um, joiner, what's it called? For the, um, the shark. motor, the shark. And while Mangus did that, he dumped me at the supermarket and came up, so I went and did all that. All the important shopping. Because we've got people coming aboard and we don't have any bedding. What's the problem, though? The problem? Right, the water's over there. And we're over here. But look at the truck, we were coming, that's where oh, yeah. we were. I'll show you where we were. That's how far we dragged it. It's way over there. Not a bad effort. I'm just going to clean his face up. What's going on, mate? What are you doing? Well, it's the ever going, ever present saga of stopping a aluminium boat bumping into cats. Because mono people don't really mind. Um, just joking. Um, and a mate of ours, Ryan and Jess, mates of ours, Ryan and Jess. He went to Bunnings, spoiled some outdoor carpet, wrapped it around with a few cable ties. It seems to work a treat. So, we went down to Bunnings yesterday, Wendy bought some carpet. I've now been tasked with the job of cutting it all to length, cutting it to size, and making it fit. Here you go. How's it going? Good, we got the first piece on. Happy Loose, with just it? Just a dry fit, yeah. yeah. And now I'm just gonna put the second piece on. Okay, then we'll look. Well, I've not much to see yet, because it's just sort of sitting there gen gently. That looks really good. Okay. I haven't tightened it up yet. Got. I don't know why the red one's there, there's Look at that. 
he's letting us know. Pretty spectacular in this when it's so calm. Another one there in front of us. Need a camera with the big zoomy lens. Yeah, it's downstairs, but it's hard to hold it still. I love the sound they make. That's pretty cool. Oh, I reckon it's bait. Oh, I just put my phone away. That was a double twist when. Look at oh! this, look! Wow, I've never seen that before. Look at this! Oh, yeah. It's probably baking season. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That is beautiful. Jesus. I'd say they'll do that again. Come on. Spectacular. Yeah, that is. That was spectacular. Oh. There you go, day one for you guys. Oh. Tick. This way. Right, this way. Oh, this way. Oh, I love how they do it. Is it too big? Got a queenie or a spaniel? I think it's a queenie. It's a number style. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, is it? I can't see it. No, it's gone down. Here it comes. Oh, yuck, it's all slimy from there. What is it? Oh, it's the tiniest little Spaniard you've ever seen in your life. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, is that small in his bait size? What is it? Spotted? Yep. Not a schoolie? No. Spotted mackerel, 60 centimetres. Yeah. Yum, yum. Don't hear a little one again. What is it? Oh, I can't tell from this distance yet. What's Silver, color? it's a mackerel. It's a little spotty. Another one? Yeah, this one's not size. Okay. It's not even a ruler. Oh, yeah, that's just a, that's a bean. Yeah. Oh, it's going back. We've arrived at Admiralty Bay. We left Broome uh, a couple of days ago, I suppose. And we are just heading in to investigate the mangroves. It's a roadstead anchorage, it's incredibly rolly, but it's what you get here because there are no bays to tuck into. So that's where we're at. We've got friends on board and uh, we're having a lovely time. See ya. Coming a long way. What is it? One and a half miles. 1.7. Yeah. Anyway, we've got rain today as well. Yeah, first rain in four months. Here are the mangroves. around yeah can you see the nest yeah she's she's uh, telling us to go away I think wow isn't that beautiful Thank you. 
the end of the road. Nothing over there. Yep. yep. So what's that? I don't know. Landstone, I don't know. Mm. Or something. Crocodile? Crocodile. Hang yeah, on. with the feet. No. It goes for oh. miles. Yeah. Can you see the boat? No. It's pouring out rain. It's going to get wet. Yep. crossing one of the uh, very ship busy shipping lanes here in Northern Australia at Port Hedland. Just advise them we'll be crossing the channel in about an hour. Uh, there's no movement so we're pretty right. You can't really see much from here. But Ships at anchor, wait to load iron ore. We've got about 120 ships on the AIS at the moment. Yeah, pretty busy. So that's all the ones at anchor. There's all the ones getting ready to move. There's one coming there. Yeah, all pretty busy. And then if I scroll down, the harbour, uh, I've three busy ones here, that's the harbour there, you can see, you can't really see all the green dots, but there are a lot of green dots there, a lot of ships, that's the channel, and we're going to cross right here, at the beginning of the channel, safest place to cross because it's narrow. It's all over and done very quickly. I've just slowed down so that the ship here 
will be this heritage. It's, gonna, it's coming down here, then he'll turn to go down here. Um, we are here, heading right across his path. So I've slowed down to about uh, just over four knots, four and a half knots, and that'll give us um, about 0.7 of a nautical mile separation. And we'll pass behind him. So we've uh, made my intentions clear, and um, that lets the skipper know what we're doing. Yeah, that's the only interaction it looks like we'll have in this minefield of ships. That's where our windlass is now. That's where our windlass used to be. See the marks there? That's where it ended up. And there's no chain left. No chain. No windlass. No anchor. Lost it all. So we're on our spare anchor and road until we can find some more chain. I'll tell you about it later. <laughs>